G'day ladies and gentlemen, this is a Space Pirates and Zombies 2 playthrough, and I am your host, Vast Dima. Last time around, we made multiple attempts at building a starbase at Cygnus Plateau, but unfortunately the zombies were having none of it. Now, we are, of course, going to attempt it once again. Of course, I do not hold out high hopes because at the end of last episode, just before we signed off, we tried it to see what would happen. And as you just saw, we have been interrupted. Now, let's see. Okay, so we're only outnumbered two to one. I'm going to try and zoom straight through the middle here. And then... Okay, so we got this little shit here with a range beam. If we can focus, well, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> he just went completely past us anyway. So let's uh, focus on this guy actually with the chainsaw beam. And fair enough. <laughs> oh damn, that dude got hammered from all sides then. Not that I'm complaining at all. Um, okay, that chainsaw beam wielding guy is going off over there, so that guy's got a plasma discharger. That guy, wasn't that the guy with the chainsaw beam? What, he has a mass driver as well? That is not a nice mix, I've got to say. Uh-huh, yep, he definitely has a mass driver as well. Well, ah, oh, damn. I really, oh, 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 his shields have dropped now. Excellent. So my mass drive should be able to get him. Just another couple of hits. A excellent. He's done. What I might do now then is uh, switch targets to the mothership. For some reason, this guy with the range beam isn't doing me a lot of um, shield damage at the moment. So I'll take advantage of that to smash flat the mothership shields. And come on, come on. You can do it. You can do it. And excellent. It's done. So now we can... Um, Get some solid hits with my mass driver. Oops, I've got to watch out. There's a guy with a mass driver pretty much behind me right now. And oh, oh that is not good timing. Not good timing. Come on, come on, come on. Let's just get away a bit. Come on. Oh, shit. Plasma discharger. Oh, excellent. Oh, that was so close. So close. Damn. Oh well, we're going to have to deal with this guy with the mass driver because our shields are a little low for comfort at the moment. And then we're going to have to um, try and get back within range of that mothership. But yeah, we definitely need to take out Mr. Mass Driver guy. Too many guys around with lasers and the like. Come on. Shields are down now. Oh, bastard. Uh, that was not good at all. At all. Okay, at least the guy with the mass driver is way outside of his range. And there we go, shields are back up. All good, all good. Okay. Okay, come on. Excellent. Well, that dude fucking got into the worst position, po position, into the worst position, got into the worst position possible and got minced by everything at once. Now, let's try and let this guy with the mass driver back into range if he is willing to come in on me, which he is. Excellent. Let's smash him flat. Uh, he's got his shields back up, but that's all right. We got, um, ooh, 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 actually, no, I'm about to run out of capacitor. That would be bad timing. We better deal with this um, guy with the range beam then first. Fantastic and fantastic. He is gone. Okay, so what the fuck do you have? You, I'm not sure, but you're dead anyway, so it doesn't really matter, does it? Okay, so... Come on, let's kill him. Come on, let's kill him. 
He has been ruining my day for so long, it is time for him to leave. Come on. Come on. There we go. He's done. Fantastic. Well, everything will be taken care of over here. Now, let's just slide along past this mothership and the rest of these guys. Uh, this guy's just got a range beam. Oh, and he has a particle hose. Little space submachine gun. And of course now I have no capacitor juice. Of course I have no capacitor juice. Fuck, I was expecting that to do more damage to him. And come on. There we go. Okay. Now this battle definitely ended up taking more time than I expected. Nothing much I can do about that though. If I could turn back time. No, I don't think we'll start singing. That's against the law after all now. What is this mothership doing? I have no idea. No idea. I don't think he has any idea. Okay. <laughs> I'm fairly sure he is trying to stay as far away from me as possible, actually. Not that I blame him. He's a mess, so... In fact... Look, he's burning, so that makes him a hot mess. Yeah, okay. I'll shut up now. And I'll pick up this hammerhead blueprint on the way through. Ooh, ooh, can we tuck inside? Yeah, fuck you, Mr. Range Beam, dude. And... Ooh, torpedo. Fantastic. Come on. Come on. Take your shields down. Take your shields down. I was sort of expecting him to have pretty much nothing in the way of shields, but uh, they seem to be quite consequential. And he's fucked now. <laughs> Commander Zip. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, he's in command of Zip now. Okay, now this guy's nearly lost his shields as well. Oh yeah, come on, ah, fantastic, we've got some decent shots off before I ran out of capacitor. Ooh, and the Dutch is gone, fantastic. Okay, well I will mop up these last three strike craft, pick up that blueprint and meet you back on the star map. So here we are at the loot screen. We've got some goodies. In fact, these two cores I might actually keep for comparison and I will chip that for sure. Oh, uh, no, nah, yep. I will definitely chip that. Okay, more levels. We, Jesus fucking Christ, level 223. That is almost ridiculous. Um, we will put up, I suppose, some health. And we might as well stick some into shield strength. And actually our health is still lagging behind, so we'll put some into health again. And maybe into reactor. There we go. Now let's go to the inventory and we will be keeping that and that and that. We'll just transfer that across and chip it. And then we'll throw that in the washing machine. And uh, there we go, two clean cores back in the inventory. Now, um, I'm only, oh, I was about to say, I'm only a little bit damaged, and by a little bit, I only need two goons to repair the little sliver of damage I took when my shields went down momentarily. Oh, do I try and take Cygnus Plateau again? I just do not know. Let's see what's in the scavenge pile. Not a great deal, uh, so I don't need to waste time picking that up. In fact, by not picking that up, it will mean that uh, hopefully the zombies that might contemplate coming and attacking me might come and pick up from the scavenge pile instead. Now, I did just quick save it, didn't I? Yes. Yes, well, I have now anyway. Um, let's try one more time to establish a Sun Hunter style base here. Come on, halfway there. Ah, bastard. Oh, no, 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 they're not attacking me. Fantastic. Okay, so 
we have built a star base here. Now, I'm not going to put a governor on it because being this close to um, heavily infested zombie territory, he's just going to get, or, or she is just going to get infected. Now, who are they fighting? Oh, they're fighting a bandit. Fair enough. Well, three guys fighting a bandit. It is none of my concern. Uh, what I do need to do, of course, is drop all this stuff into the personal stash and repair that little sliver of damage. Now, I still have enough scrap to build yet another starbase, so I might as well go along to Epsilon Prime and try and build one there. And after that, I am going to hit up some uh, pirate bases. Of course, I won't make you watch that. Uh, I will just edit that out. And I am definitely interrupted this time. Looks like this is going to be a 1v3. And... Oh, no, no. It's only 1v2. Okay, let's... Um... Yeah, we'll turn to port, and... Ooh, damn, they're really keeping up with me this time. And straight to all the space junk. Of course, if it's not a rock, it's floating debris. Okay, okay. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Okay. Let's see, okay, we'll stay uh, ahead of this mothership with the range beam, but not too far ahead. Oh, holy shit, he's lost his shields already, but I am about to lose my capacitor. But the good thing is, I still do have two-thirds of my shields left, so if I can just stay fairly close-ish. Come on, come on, come on, yes, excellent, and come on, pretty much one more shot should do it. Fantastic, so stand, 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 the man has been taken out. Um, okay, let's try and spin around and get the other mothership. Hopefully we'll get back up to, say, half shields by the time we get around here. Excellent, excellent. Okay. I might have to target this guy. He's just sitting right on top of me. Uh, that guy with the shotgun isn't doing too much damage. Okay. Okay, fair enough. Fantastic, in fact. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Let's just stay a little bit ahead. Come on, excellent. Okay. Okay, and fair enough. That's done. Holy shit, that is awesome. Now, let's just uh, take care of all these little guys. Um, in fact, with five strike craft left in my pool... Uh, I don't see these guys causing any problems whatsoever. So I will, even though there are six of them left, I will meet you back on the star map once I have dealt with them all. Wow, well, here we are on the loot screen and we have all sorts of stuff. Explosive warheads and uh, cloud torpedoes and all sorts of nastiness as well as 607 res. That is fantastic. We'll take all of that. And, of course, we've gone up some levels, so I will uh, pump some more into... Hmm. Actually, they're all equal, so I will put it into weapon damage. And some into shield strength. Okay, so only two levels that time. That's not too bad. And uh, let's just check out the scavenge pile underneath us. Ooh, 303 res. That is rather tempting, but once again... While I am uh, building this starbase, hopefully the uh, zombies in the vicinity will go for the scavenge pile instead. Yes, yes, yes. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, so close yet so far. Oh, my God. Oh, well, the scaffold. I only recently kicked your ass. I remember doing it. Okay. Well... We'll just have to do it again. Nothing much we can do about that. Okay, so let's twist again. Let's um, head to port and... Ooh, ooh, damn. Lots of blowy-uppy stuff around me. 
Okay, and into a rock, of course. You know, that's always a uh, wise tactical manoeuvre. And... Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Did we get it? No, nowhere near it, actually. There we go. There we go. Let loose with everything. And take down his shields. Come on. No, I'm going to have to change fire to this guy with the chainsaw beam, I think. Ooh, that's not good. Ooh, that's not good. Come on, get out of range of that chainsaw beam. Oh, you're kidding me. Oh, just... Oh, and he's got a range beam as well. That is not good. Not good whatsoever. Yep, kill everything around us. Just kill it all. Excellent. Okay, fair enough. We will also target this guy. What else we got around us? That guy's way out of range, so that's good. Oh, are you kidding me? Come on. The fuck? Ah. So first, it won't let me grab it at all, and then it floats all the way over there. There we go. Okay, so... While I was fucking around doing that, I have went so far away from the battle, it is ridiculous. Let's get back in the fight then, shall we? Okay. What am I down to? Two strike craft, that's not too bad. Okay, so that guy had an... I'm sure that's an iron beam. Yeah, yeah, that's an iron beam. I haven't seen one of them for a while, actually. And... So we've got guys with torpedoes. Oh, God. Regular lasers. Zapper drones. All sorts of garbage running around here. Actually, I think the zapper drones were... Oh, no, no. My guys' zapper drones and somebody else's zapper drones as well. Craziness out there. Okay. Okay, I can only see um, the Zapper Drones from my strike craft now. So either the guy with the Zapper Drones is now out of range or I have killed him. Okay. So we got a guy with a cruel blade floating around. What else we got? Okay, I saw a range beam. I think that was from the mothership. Yep, that was definitely from the mothership. Ooh, damn, that mothership is getting rather close-ish. Come on, boost away from him. There we go, we're out of range beam range now. So that guy's got a sniper cannon. And come on, come on. There we go, excellent. And that's the little shit with the iron beam. I should probably deal with him, actually. I had best deal with him. Okay. Smash him to pieces. There we go. There we go. Come on. You've got him. Fantastic. Okay, let's not let this guy get into range beam range, but we've got to also keep him... Oops. Also got to keep him within sniper cannon range, which is 500, of course. So, oh, damn, he keeps on sneaking up. He's nearly gone now. And wax off. Wax on, wax off. Okay. Okie dokie. And looks like there goes the last of my strike craft, but I'm fairly sure that um, that must be the last of his as well. Because there's only three, not four in uh, the battle space at the moment. Okay, and this guy just lost his shield, so he's about to get thumped by my mouse driver. And thumping ensues. Ensues. In <clears throat> Excuse me. I will shut up now. There's my water. Oh, it's just a little bit out of reach. That was silly. Ooh, here we are. Oh, no. He does have another, but it must have been in one of the same hangers as one of the other guys before. So, one of his hangers, or two of his hangers, are empty. Come on. Come on. Come on, let's finish this guy off. Come on, we're close, we're close. 
Oh, great. Okay. Not so close when we are out of capacitor juice. Oops. That's not what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted to do. Come on, take down his shields. Come on. Ooh. <laughs> there goes the engines, fucker. <laughs> Try getting away from me now. <laughs> Uh, uh, there we go. The scaffold has once again hung himself. Okay, now we've got um, two strike craft left, so I'll deal with these guys and I will meet you back on the star map. Or oh, actually, I'll meet you back on the loot screen, I'm guessing. And here we are. We've got some loot, a uh, bunch of cores. Two of which are worth keeping. Well, I'm just going to press take all now before I make a hideous mistake once again. Um, but we will rinse that one and we'll rinse that one. And then we will chip the rest of this garbage. I forgot to chip after the last battle, so we will have lots of chippage to do. There we go. Um... Mm, levels again. Reactor, shield, reactor, shield, reactor. Armor. Um, actually, yeah, more armor. We're starting to lag behind on the whole armor thing. Now, do we attempt to build a base at Epsilon Prime? Because we are damaged. 15% damage, in fact. Hmm. Okay, let's see where the zombie alpha is as well. Because um, that is, after all, fairly important. So he has re -inchipinated. And it looks like he's headed to the ditch. Yes, he is indeed headed to the ditch. So, what I might do is... I already did quick save it, didn't I? I'm fairly sure I did, but I'll do it again. And scavenge, <gasps> scavenge pile is significant. Oh, no, I've got to pick that up. I can't. I can't leave it. I just can't. And I got another big core as well. Okay, we'll do a quick save. I might have to save scum here. And if I can't build the base, I might have to head back to my base and repair and everything. Um, yeah, no, no, no. I'm going to just have to save scum out of that. There's no way. Uh, well, <sighs> nah, I'd best go repair. We'll see where the zombie alpha is at that stage. And, um, oop, oop, I just remembered I've got to uh, give that a rinse as well. Uh, we'll drop off all this shit. Repair. And I just realised I am way over with my uh, goons as well. So I'll drop off 1120 of these. We're as close as I can get to it. Yep, that's good enough. And, um... Uh, let's have a look at where this fucking ditch monkey is. Um, okay, we'll head back to here-ish. Oops, there-ish. Um, and what I might do is I might... Might try and build a base at Epsilon Prime. Maybe that would be a bad mistake there. Uh, because if I get ship beaten out of me, then I would have to go all the way back to Cygnus Plateau to repair and then to the ditch. Um, okay, where's Shithead? There. Uh, then again, I'd be waiting quite a while for him to catch up over there. I guess I could if there is a full... There we go. I'll go to this bandit hive and I will loot it. That's what I'll do. And then by the time I finish doing that, um, the zombie alpha should be at the ditch and I will be able to defeat him and send him on a long trek back to the capital. Now, you've seen me knock out zombie hives again and again and again, so... I won't make you watch me instead. I will uh, join you back on the star map once I am done. So here we are back at the star map, having looted all of the goodies from that pirate hive there. And the zombie alpha is indeed down at uh, 
the Starbase, Starbase location for the ditch. So, now that we've got him here, let's kick the shit out of him. Wait, either I've gone blind or nobody came to his aid. <gasps> nobody came to his aid. Nobody came to his aid. Nobody came to his aid. Nobody, 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 nobody came to his aid. Yes, I know. That was singing and I'm not allowed to do that, but come on. I couldn't help it. <laughs> and goodbye, zombie alpha. <laughs> uh, as alpha sides go, that was quite enjoyable, I've got to say. <laughs> uh, okie dokie. Um... He's only got the three uh, strike craft left, but um, you never know. This can take longer than you'd expect. Oh, actually, it looks like I'm nearly done now. So there is no need to edit that out at all. Okay, back to the star map we go. <laughs> uh, a fine spot of Alpha Zide. Uh, interesting range beam on a militia large wing. But, um, ooh, ooh, we've gone up more levels. Well, I doubt we've gone up levels, not, <laughs> not with that pitiful fight. So we will put up uh, more armor and maybe some more health. Okay, I am surprised, actually. I thought it would... I didn't even think I'd make one level, let alone two. Um... Okay, so the scavenge pile is pointless. Um, of course, one thing I have to decide is, do I go up and try and build the base at Epsilon Prime, or do I just try and build one at the ditch while I'm down here? Uh, there's a few zombies around, but not a lot. But the problem is, there's not a lot of zombies up near Epsilon Prime either, and I'd rather grab it right now if i could oh then again oh stuff it now I, I really want to get that one at epsilon prime done because it is just becoming difficult okay well i'm not damaged or anything so this would be perfect come on let me build it ah bugger okay fucking dingleberry yeah, I know that's not his name, but in my mind, that's what I'm calling him. Fucking Dingleberry. Okay, so we'll go to port. Um, okay, let's just see. Oops, I just picked up a uh, shield power up, but that's all right. Uh huh. Okay, his shields are nearly down. And there we go, his shields are down. Fantastic. If we can just smash him apart a little, that would be awesome. Come on. Come on. I th oh, yeah, something just came off for sure. Damn, nearly down at half shields, but I've still got quite a bit of capacitor. Nah, I'm going to have to get out of there. Maybe my uh, strike craft will be able to finish him off, I'm not sure. But um, me, I definitely need to get out of here. Because I'm going to run out of capacitor fairly shortly. And there we go. I would rather be away from the uh, primary crush of battle. Okay, excellent. What, what's he doing? Is he coming towards me? Because if he's coming towards me, I will just slow right down and oblige him. Yes, yes, he is. He's going to be in mass driver range any second. And he still hasn't got his shields up. Oh, yeah, yeah, come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Dingle Lord is done for. Fucking fantastic. Okay. Well, we will... Release my guys from focus. Fuck, that dude got annihilated quick, didn't he? Okay, that was weird. And... He's gone as well. How many have we got ahead of us? Just this one. But we are around running out of capacitor juice. So let's just stay out of uh, range of this guy's pulses. Now that our capacitor is back, let's um, let him get a bit closer. And by closer I mean within... Ooh, shit, he's got a lot of pulses. 
Okay. Okay, that's all right. It's all right. Uh huh. Uh huh. His shields are nearly down. Shields are nearly down. There we go. They're down. He's fucked now. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yep, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. And. Oh, come on. Come on, guys. You're right on top of him. Smash him for me. And there we go. Zoe, you are finished. Okay, so what have we got? We've just got the four strike craft to go. And I still have two on the board. Fantastic. Well, I will meet you all back at the star map. Okay, here we are back on the star map. Well, on the loot screen technically, but uh, once I pick it up, we're back on the star map. And levels, levels, levels. Um, uh, um, reactor. There we go. That'll do. And we want to go to the infantry because I am actually building up a large collection of utter fucking garbage and we'll transfer that across and chip it all for res and then i will avoid burping into the microphone because that would be gross now i see a hell of a lot of zombies around and how much do you want to bet they will interfere with my plans to construct a base on epsilon prime um yeah, it wouldn't uh, be much of a bet, that's for sure. Anyway, we are still going to try once again. Okay, about halfway there. Oh, son of a bit. Stitchy, holy fucker. You're going to need stitches once I get through with you, motherfucker. <sighs> Deep breath. Okay. The good thing is I managed to uh, take Cygnus Plateau, so... That was just as tricky to take. Oh, damn, ran straight into a sign. It's probably advertising fucking driving lessons or something. Okay. That's... Oh, excellent. Well, that guy is out of shield, so I imagine my master driver will be targeting him any second. Ooh, ooh, excellent. This mothership's nearly out of shields too. Yes, it is out of shields. Fantastic. Come on. Crumble a few bits off him before I run out of capacity juice. Oh yeah, solid hits, solid hits, solid hits. Okay, we're going to have to... Oh shit! Damn! It took way more damage. Oh, plasma discharge. I was wondering what um, wiped out all of my shields in uh, with such rapidity. And it was, of course, a fucking plasma discharger. What else would it be? Okay, let's get out of range of that fucking sniper gun. Okay, excellent. Our shields are back. That is fantastic. Now, there is a lot of nastiness out there. There's a guy over there with a chainsaw beam. And... Ooh, ooh, this mothership is sliding back within... Oh, no. There, his shields are back up. That's annoying. That's annoying. Son of a bitch. Okay. And out of capacity juice again. But it looks like my uh, strike craft may come through for me and wipe out that mothership. Maybe, maybe, maybe not. And yep, between me and the strike craft, we took him out. Awesome. Okay, so I have one strike craft left on the... Actually two left on the board. I was about to say one on the board and one in uh, the pool, but there we are. There's two on the board now. And actually I will just release them to do whatever the fuck they want. Don't want them doing something stupid like heading straight towards his mothership. Ooh, he has a range beam. Come on, let's boost out of him. There we go. There we go. Let's try and stay at around 450. I'm going to... Come on, a little bit further ahead. There we go. There we go. Come on. He keeps doing these little boosts and catching up to me, little cheeky bastard. Ah, there we go. His shields are gone. And that means he will be quickly done for. Okay, I'm out of strike craft, but that's all right. 
wants some um, bubble <laughs> wants bubbles <laughs> oh bubbles sorry bubbles you've blown your last bubble it looks like so um now that bubbles is gone we merely have seven holy fuck seven strike craft to take on so i will meet you back at the star map well at the loot screen on the star map okie dokie here we are back on the loot screen and we have lots of goodies nothing that i want to keep but um still lots of stuff that will make for a big pile of res once i chip it up oh, and of course we want to choose our level perks um yeah I'll put some into health put some into reactor and put some into some more into health and of course then we will go back to the uh, infantry and we will of course chip all of this for res hey that's fantastic 2324 awesome we're building up quite a supply of res which will let us uh cure quite a few of the captains floating around in fact i might have to just start uh curing any captain i come across rather than holding out to cure my uh my former comrades uh but i just realized i am actually out of time so while i didn't manage to take epsilon prime i did manage to finally establish a star base at cygnus plateau and committed alpha side once again at the ditch so that will uh take him take the zombie out for quite a while to get back to the capital now um for next episode of course the plan is to continue taking these star bases uh, i don't quite have enough for three but i have enough for two and for plenty of strike craft replacements which is you know fairly good in and of itself after that of course um i will probably raid some pirate hives and i want to establish bases on these four territories back here of course i anticipate those being a lot easier to establish bases on but yeah other than that i am quite happy at how things are going as we can see um my power level is up to 433 and theirs has dropped to 542 so we are slowly but surely getting to the point where i will be able to annihilate the capital and finish off the zombie alpha once and for all and that's it for this episode give me your thoughts down below and like and subscribe as you will until next time take care of yourselves and most importantly have a good one!